Hello, uh, my name is Raid Shakur from Rushtronics. Uh, today I'm going to show our uh, new multifunction for uh, controlling the turn signals and cruise control installed in the new Ford Explorer. So this is the uh, the Ford Explorer with the new gear shifter with the rotary, uh, rotary switch. Uh, this is our uh, multi-can, multi-lin gateway and uh, this is the input device. Of course, any other input devices using the RJ12 here like low effort switches or just using uh, replacing this in device with a voice scan or any other system this gateway has a dual lin so the lin bus we have to cut the lin bus to activate or to control the wipers uh, we have to cut the can bus to activate the high beam and turn signals and cruise control through these two lines so we have uh, can one can two and uh, on the factory on the factory so here we as we can see so these are the two uh, two yellow wires uh, the one with the blue which is going to the to the uh, connector here yellow blue is going to the uh, connector when once we cut the the uh, the lin bus uh, wire and the other one and this is the other end of course and uh, the can bus we cut the can here as can be seen and we pass it through the gateway so we have the uh, connector side and the body control motor side after cutting uh, the can okay now this way this allows us uh, this allows us to uh, to control many functions uh, so here I'm going to show uh, for the for the wipers as an example so uh, shortly press to activate the uh, the intermittent wipe of course this is speed dependent oh no this is the high speed this is the off when double beep is the off first one is the intermittent wipe and this one is the uh, speed dependent so uh, basically you can set the speed here on the on the stalks and the uh, and the factory and you can use use it normally okay so here we have the uh, intermittent now it's waiting for the car to move or just for rain if i press again so i get the normal wipe or the low speed and the rapid wipe, which is the high speed, and off. Now, of course, uh, press and hold for the wash, for the same switch here. So we can wash it we, even with the normal speed here, while the normal speed is working, so I can press and hold to wash the system will wash and continue as normal. So here, the same with the high speed, so it will go to the low speed, okay? And off. Now, of course, the turn signal or the shortly press for the flash. Press and hold for the high beam. Of course, the car will or the van will turn on the headlights or the auto lights and they will continue to work normally. So press and hold, press and hold, press and hold, shortly press, shortly press, shortly press. The same for turn signal. So it must be short press, not like everyone is pressing and holding and waiting for something to happen. So shortly press, shortly press. Of course, okay. Now the uh, regarding the cancellation. So here I'm indicating uh, left. So I'm going to rotate the steering to the opposite direction. As can be seen that the wipers, that the turn signal are still on. Now when I straighten the steering, it doesn't cancel. Only when I turn left and return. The same thing for the uh, for the right side. So I can turn right and it cancels on return or I indicate right if I go to an roundabout on return then I have to, to turn a little bit slightly uh, to the right and uh, it cancels. Of course I can also even override so if I indicate on factory the factory is indicating left now and if I press press the round device here to the right so we can override the factory switches Okay, now if I cancel my turn signals from the round device, okay, it returns back to the uh, factory switch here. Okay, now I'm gonna turn it off. Now also this system supports cruise control. So um, on, on all our systems, so the left turn signal, okay, so we can shortly press to indicate left, but if I press and hold, it activates the, uh, it turns on the cruise control and it, it uh, automatically sets the speed. So there is no need to previously start or turn on the, uh, before starting the driving. 
um, so there is no need to start or to press cruise on and then set so the system will know that the cruise is off it sets so here I turn it off from the steering now the cruise is off so if I shortly press here I activate press and hold the uh, again turn off so again I'm gonna show the so press and hold it, it activates and set and shortly press this is short So there is no need to turn it off and just we can just cycle left right le the, the way we like thank you